Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Jim. What's going on? Here. Someone tries to wave up whatever's on the top corner thing on the left. Maybe? I don't know. So I made a Borderlands 2 game, uh, gameplay a couple days ago, and I wanted to do that more. So I'm gonna be playing one of my favorite series of all time, Mass Effect. All right, let's get into it. And we pan out. Fantastic. Oh, okay. Now, I've only played, um, part of the third one, if you, uh, watched my very own gameplay for the camera, which sucked. But, uh, I didn't actually finish the third one, but I decided, you know, might as well go in order. So, here Welcome we go. Welcome to Alliance Military Database. Okay. Classified information requested. Uh, I guess? Question mark? Establishing secure connection. Oh, it's because we're not on. Secure connection confirmed. John Shepard. Enter new ID. Select the existing. Uh, let's enter a new one. Uh, let's go custom mail. Let's. Hmm. Name. Good name. Something very intimidating. Gustavo. Done. Gustavo Shepard. Please log in to access your profile. Yes. Gustavo Shepard. He is the one who will save us all. Oh boy. Warning. Data corruption detected. Uh, Someone's on a website that they were supposed to be on. Just Please there. reconstruct profile. What is my problem? Confirm pre-service history. Okay. Spacer, both of your parents were in the Alliance military. Your childhood was spent on ships and stations as they were transferred from posting to posting, never staying in one location for more than a few years. Following your parents' both of you and listening at the age of 18. Maybe. Colonists who were born on and raised on Ningalore. Uh, small, blah, blah, blah. There's 16 slavers right- Ooh. Surrounding your family at friends? Oh, no. Poor thing. We're saying my family and less of these. Okay. Who are a working race on a stream of blah blah blah? You skip the life of penny crime and other world games? Hmm. I don't think Spacer would get much of a story in this game, if you don't know. It's basically your choices affect the entire game. So. I'm thinking of the colonists Earthborn. Colonists have a lot, you know, Confirm like psychological profile. Okay, so it's about blah, 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 blah. Oh, what are we Well, war hero. That's the that's your own life is saving fellow soldiers and defeat the enemy just fighting from the line. That doesn't really lose legs. I, I don't really see the main characters being such a bad guy. Soul survivor that gives Confirm much more of a military story. specialization. Okay, soldier, blah blah blah. Medium armor, specialized in heavy armor. Ooh. Well, that, 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 that's it. You get this fancy little glove and pistol. Holographic Omni. Oh, right, 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 right. Omni tool from the third game. Got it. And, oh. Very glowy. Uh, that you can only use light armor and can receive a. Oh, that's terrible. Infiltrator. So, this guy has the um, the tool on him. Sniper rifle? That. And Sentinel has the Omni tool and glowy hands. And Dark has glowy hands and a shocker. Soldier. You want to all want to look cool. Confirm facial identification. Change appearance. Let's make him fabulous. No. 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 Not really. Here we go. Not told by now. Let's make him slightly Hispanic. Because Gustavo deserves something Hispanic. Uh. Ooh, ooh. That one. Definitely. Head. Neck thickness. Neck can be thick. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. I'm pretty sure that has nothing to do with anything. It's just. Face size, and that's like his cheekbone. 
I don't want to deal with any of that. I, I shake. Ah! That was a little creepy. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> he just looked like he did not get it. Why is there like no good eye? Oh, he looks. I, I, whatever. Iris color. Let's give him innocent. No, that's not That's. That was good. Jaw. Don't want to deal with that. Mouth. Oh my god, this reminds me of my first time game playing. Uh, basically, the first time I made a Mass Effect character, I gave this guy, like, these kind of lips. Like, because they look good, but when we looked at them again, they were, like, very. We called it Trouty Mouth. I don't know why, but. Uh, good times. And now I have no lips. Give him this one. There we go. Nose! Let's see what we can do with this. This is. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. I don't see the difference. <laughs> I'm gonna go with the default one. No, this is. Yeah, that one's good. Hair. Ooh. Ooh, let's give him a beard. Make him. Give a story. Yeah. Uh, brow. I don't really care about that. Hair. Uh, okay. No. I kind of like that one. Messy. Not really messy. I don't like the messy. Not really a spiky one. Let's... Let's go with this one. Wait, I'm almost done. Hair color. Oh my gosh. Blonde. So blonde. Facial hair color. Yeah, that's my name. And, and finalize. Profile reconstruction. Now, doesn't that look like the Savior of the Galaxy? And confirm. Identification confirmed. Comment level. Let's stick with normal. Auto level up. I want to do that. Subtitles. Definitely. Target is set. I have no idea. Prompt. Prompt. Okay. Let's go. Wait, what are those things called again? They, they have a name. I forgot what it was called, though. Ah, it's gonna bug me. Ooh, darkness. Hi, Earth. Red. Well, what about Shepard? He grew up in the colonies. He knows how tough life can be out there. His parents were killed when slavers attacked Mindwar. My poor parents. He saw his whole unit die on a cruise. On a what? He could have some serious emotional scars. Oh, a okay. cruise. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? Yes. That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. Thank you. I'll make the call. Call on your Nokia cell phone. Right now. In the year 2148, explorers of Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spare bearing civilization with the tickets that follow. These mysterious artifacts revealed the start of a new technology, enabling travel to the present star. The race of this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of time and space. They called it a great discovery of humanity, and they called it a mass effect. Oh my god, that was scary. Ooh, I lost a lot of words there. <coughs> like my narrator voice? Yeah, amazing. The Arcturus Prime relay is in range. Initiating transmission sequence. And is that, that, is that blue or Uranus? Don't know. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. I that was very good. Really is hot. Acquiring a protractor. I've been cooling off. Blue station secure for transit. What is transit? Tell me your way is white one. It looks like Torchenegger on his face. Oh my god, that's great. Wait, did you go through that? Wait, wait. Like right there! Three, two, oh, wow. So that's like going in that hyperspace. 
Thrusters, check. Navigation, That's not check. green. Internal emissions sync engaged. Yeah, it's not green. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. I don't know if that's good or bad, but, you know. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. Nick Hiller? I hate that guy. <laughs> of course. Nihilus gave you a call. Oh, it's Nihilus. So Got you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. If you say so, man. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like Is having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Okay, so here's our first choice of the game. And... <laughs> Arnie does not look happy. Uh, let's see. Uh, we'll just take our, okay, I got that. Thank you. You're overreacting. You always expect the worst. <laughs> now bad feelings are an occupational hazard. I made the best character. We don't go anywhere that. unless there's a good reason. So, what are we doing here? Joker. Status report. Oh boy. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Yeah. Good. Is that Find a com buoy and link us Ooh, to a the buoy. Place. I want mission reports relayed okay. back to Alliance Brass before we reach the Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Awkward. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? The President Gustav. I'm on my way. Is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Just you. Only when he's talking to you, Joe. <laughs> awesome. All right. Well, that was the first talking that we ever did, I guess. And I guess this is the ship we're on. I don't remember this from the third game. Well, that's also because I never really finished the third game yet. We're getting dragged. Only Matt did the first couple of missions, then I need to You're give yourself an stop. Uh, yeah, I don't know. Should I talk to me? Let's talk to this guy, Navigator. Preston? Preston? Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. How smooth? You heading smooth down to see the Captain? Uh, yeah. I'm on my way to give him a status update right now. Do what With all due respect, sir, maybe he'll finally tell you what we're really doing out here. Oh, what do you mean by that? Huh? You think the Alliance Brass is holding out on us? If all we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system, why is Captain Anderson in charge? Because and then there's the Nihilus. Captain. Spectres are elite operatives, top I mean, why would you say why do we need a captain? Why send a spectre? A, a Turian spectre captain. on a shake I mean, come on. run. It doesn't add up. Hmm. I'm, I'm going to be kind of jerk right here. Info's on a need-to-know basis, Presley. Just follow the orders you're given. <laughs> Understood, Commander. You know what? So I'm gonna go with the sports. What is who is this? Chukowatz? What do you think, Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real action. I sincerely yeah, hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Yeah, she's got a point. Only a fool goes looking for a fight, Corporal. Sorry, Commander, but this waiting's killing me. I've never oh, been on a mission like this before, not one with a Spectre on board. You'll be fine. Just treat this like every other assignment you've had and everything I don't really want to do the whole investigation. Easy for you to say. I don't know. You proved yourself on a coos. Everybody knows a what you oh, can do. Coos. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. Don't play the hero. This mission isn't about personal glory, Corporal. We have a job to do. Don't do anything stupid to mess it up. Don't worry, sir. I'm not going to screw this up. The captain's waiting for me. Goodbye, He's Please. Well, this is quite eventful. I'm gonna pause it right here. Thanks for watching. Oh, well, that's a thing. Yeah, I don't know. Let me know what you want me to do next. Uh, leave comments on what you want me to do. If you want me to be a good guy or a bad guy, I'm open to suggestions.